All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Tower of God season two, episode nine. Uh, in the last episode, it was the time skip, apparently, like the two year, three year time skip. I can't remember what it was, but there was a time skip, pretty big one. Um, I was wondering as to why everybody kind of looked the same, um, especially at least the, at the very least the young child. Um, but you guys let me know that um, probably something I was already aware of in the anime, but just completely forgotten, uh, which is aging is tremendously slowed uh, within the tower. Which is interesting, so yeah, I guess they're all kind of probably the same age. Um, probably It's probably been like a few months worth of time within their bodies, I suppose. Uh, which is good to know, interesting. Um, yeah, and then we were also, as it was, it seemed random as hell, but it's probably going to be like going towards something in the future. Uh, we we're introduced to like this AI bot called Emily, uh, when in reality apparently it is someone behind it. It's not like AI, it's like a person locked up somewhere, attached some cables and shit. And uh, it's able to kind of predict certain events within like the tower or within like competitions or challenges or whatever. So that was interesting. And uh, there was also a person there that was like, I'm going to come save you type thing because he knows Emily is a person. But yeah, uh, very interesting. Obviously a lot I'm confused about at the moment, but I'm sure it'll all come together at some point. So uh, yeah, as always guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. Oh yeah, and he asked the bot if Bam was alive as well. That was easy enough. Not even I know that? Wow. Are you curious? Yeah, of course. <laughs> this fucking bot. He do be indeed. The devil of the right arm. Oh! That's our boy from the old group. Is it? It looks, well, it, it kind of does and doesn't look like him. Because he's got the, like the wing, but his hair color's different and he looks smaller? What the fuck? Yeah, uh, I'm guessing it's not him. Maybe his brother or something? The devil of the right arm. My brother. Oh, damn. <laughs> he didn't say it. Maybe it's his brother, maybe it's not. Who knows? Oh, okay, so... Foster kids, then. Or orphans. Damn, bro. Uh, well, they're pulling up to the workshop soon. That is a crazy existence. Jeez. Oh, they're like mounted on the wall? What the hell? He kind of has Bam's face. Never mind, he doesn't. From the side, it looked like he did. I think a lot of people are smaller than you. Yeah, so technically brothers. Is this the motherly figure? I'm getting Trigun Stampede vibes. <laughs> And then something dastardly happens to her, probably. Oh. Damn. Oh, so she was a good person. <laughs> oh. What the hell is going on here? Is this how they got these wing things implanted in them? Out of almost 100,000 people. Wow. Something tells me this is going to be very painful. Half of this devil. Is that why they've only got one wing each? Yeah, very painful. Figures. My god. Couldn't they just knock them out like you have to put them through that pain? Ah, so they do have the wing on the opposite side of the body. Damn, they got her. Oh, his goes downwards. Oh, he looks gone. Damn. We mean transported, like, randomly over the ocean? Okay. Oh, this fucking guy. Someone broke me out. 
Wait, so are they, was Kun's group looking for him, or were they looking for the other dude? Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh boy. Sounds to me like they may have to fight. Or they may un may end up fighting. <laughs> the way they just all decided that. I mean, yeah, after hearing that story, you'd have to go, you'd ha want to help him. Are you, are you with us, Veal? What is this, a PlayStation 3? Oh yeah, I guess he does go by uh, a different name. Oh my god. Get this woman out of the kitchen, Jesus. Uh, you can tell? How do you burn rice like that? That's crazy. <laughs> How about just say, no, your cooking sucks. She won't eat her own cooking? That's crazy. What a tremendous waste of food. What is that in the middle? Like molten lava? I mean, Bam, Bam doesn't seem to mind it too much. How are y'all not throwing up? Why? What, what y'all got to talk about? I was, was he experimented on as well? Oh, shit. So is this something happened between the events of Season 1 and Season 2, then? Y'all fighting? Oh, boy. I don't know if you want this, bro. I think Bam gonna handle you. Maybe, maybe Bam's like a natural born or something like that. I don't know. Maybe it didn't happen between Season 1 and Season 2. Did he tank that shit? Oh, he stopped. Wow. He doesn't actually want to hurt him. I believe him. He don't got a clue. He just kind of appeared one day. How to become a god. Right? Oh shit, so the same thing happened to him, but in like a different place and not, not, not like a facility. So he probably met, like, the devil itself or something. So I think the, the other place, like, captured, like, a smaller devil. And Bam met, like, one of the big boys, maybe. Yeah. That's definitely not a Bam thing to do. You left? What do you mean you left? The squad's here for you. You're not walking away from this group, bro. I get where he's coming from, but they're, they're definitely still going to follow him. So is it, I just realized, like... I mean, actually, no, it does look different. I was thinking, like, the black stuff he's got wrapped around his wrist was the same stuff he had on in, like, the test tube, but it does look like something different. Damn, bro. I suppose they have been together for a few years, like. Are you gonna, uh, are you gonna tell them? Oh, come on, bro. What should you wear tomorrow? The same shit you always wear. I know you're lying. You're not gonna change clothes. <laughs> I would like to see it. I wouldn't drink the tea. I should probably find a way to burn that. Why is uh, Kun's group looking, this, looking for this guy, I wonder? Bird flu, yeah. If this isn't properly taken care of, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I, I believe him. <laughs> Wait, well, so why are they going after this dude? The three strongest boys? Oh shit. Right, so that was Tower of God, Season 2, Episode 9. Uh, good little episode there. Uh, it was interesting to find out about Kang's past. Uh, I wonder if, like, going forward, he'll, like, want to stick with the name Kang, or if he'll want to go back to, kind of, his old name, and now that we know it, I guess. Um, I guess we'll see. Um, 
but yeah, good episode. Finding out about Kang's brother, um, and now they're kind of on the way. Well, he's on the way. Kun's group are on the way. Um, whether or not kind of Bam's group go there as well. Obviously, they're not going to probably know where where to look for him. But yeah, it's going to be interesting to find out, see what's going to happen. Um, obviously, they're not going to leave him behind. Like you said, they are his family now, and I'm sure they feel the same way about him. So they're going to help out in some way. And I guess we're going to see what's going to happen when uh, he meets with his brother again. Ideally, like in an ideal world, he'd uh, he'd join our group, yeah, and that'd be great, you know? One more person added to the group. But it's, it's Tower of God. It's probably not going to be an ideal world. Probably something's going to go down. He might even lose him. So, um, yeah. Got to find out more as well about the or Bam's kind of ability. Um, obviously, he's met some kind of devil himself, and so the kind of same kind of thing that's happened to Kangas happened to him as well. Um, very interesting. But yeah, anyway guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching, watching my reaction today. Have a nice rest of your day, and peace out.